Dead Space franchise, stepping into Isaac Clarke's role, um, this guy had never spoken before. Uh, there was already a, a fan base to the franchise. And um, I, I think I put a lot of pressure on myself as an actor, just in the back of my mind, wanting to do a great job and, and to hopefully have the fans connect. And that's what's so cool about seeing, um, now that the game's out, and uh, getting all the tweets and, and a lot of the Facebook comments just saying great job or we love the game. It just makes you feel so good. So, you know, you just know that if nothing else, you were in that wheelhouse and, and you gave the fans what they were hoping uh, to, uh, to see and hear. So um, it's great, it's a great feeling. I think Isaac Clark really represents the type of roles that I like best because he's a guy's guy, he's a normal dude, he's someone that um, is just thrusted into some extreme circumstances. But uh, again, he, he shows the true character of a, of a human being, someone who does want to survive, someone who does want to just get through that next door. And that resonates a lot with me. I've, I've had a chance lately to play a few similar characters, and I don't know, I just find them much more, probably truer to myself, but also there's so many more layers to a, a person like that. Um, and I think they're a lot more real. I think a lot of people can relate to an Isaac Clark. You complete bastard. Was this your great plan? Dump me off and die. It's all about ideas, remember? Yeah, well, here's another one. I'm crashing through the roof to get you. Now move your ass. Wait, no, Ellie. Ellie, it's too late. Set through the station. Yeah, well, you don't really have a say this time. Heads up. Both like brunettes. Um, definitely like zero G, and uh, we both don't like to die, especially in the kind of ways that uh, these crazy people here like to uh, orchestrate death. I got a tweet from a Dead Space Two fan. She said, uh, "Are you doing a Cadillac commercial?" And I tweeted her, said, yeah, where did you hear it? She's like, uh, oh, it's on CNN or something like that. So I thought that was pretty cool. <laughs>